we've got a lot of stuff to talk about sit back and relax and smash that like button let's get into it what is up guys it's soul bash welcome back we are back with some more mobile legends news and updates and today i've actually got a good bit of stuff to talk about it's kind of mixed variety of things that are going to be happening over the next month in the game and to begin with yeah straight out the gate as you've seen moscow is gonna pretty much get a nerf uh first thing out of the gate is they said moscow is too strong uh they are discussing that and we will get into that a little bit later in the video but i want to go ahead and go over some of this other stuff that they're going to change up as well uh the third skill for karina and saber which is the ultimates uh they've had a lot of complaints about that being able to hit minions instead of actual just heroes so what they're doing is they're planning on being able to fix this uh they're saying this will possibly be fixed in version 1.1.86 but it could be a slight variance depending on the schedule uh so within the next month or so you can expect them to fix the karina and saber ultimates to where they can't be able to hit hero or not heroes but they can't he hit minions anymore um after that let's see they are going to change if you use like uh, bluetooth earphones or anything like that they're changing that in the next update 8.4 uh, to make the compatibility a lot smoother and uh, just make it sound a lot better also in one of the next coming updates they are planning to make a what they're calling a business card page in your profile so you can easily introduce yourself i'm assuming that's in the game um and also they have stated that in in the update times when the ping is stable it's still showing green but it pops to a red image uh what they're saying is it's not a problem of the network it's actually because you're downloading game data during combat and that's what the problem is when they're doing the updates um i, I had a lot of problems with this actually in the previous update uh we were playing and everything was fine and then it seemed like they just started updating the servers and what it was is they actually released the update from the app store and it had just started downloading in the background and that's what is affecting a lot of people's gameplays and it's usually in between like a monday or wednesday when they update that and that's when that's really actually happening uh, but they are looking to change that and what they said is they're not they're going to make it to where you can't download stuff resources during combat so when you're in matches it will not be downloading the actual resources for the game for that patch and they've also stated that the gray screen that you've been getting after you try to invite a friend or delete a friend or deny a friend it's not going to turn gray anymore after the 8.2 version so that will be updated all right now for the juicy part of the matter what we all wanted to hear about moscow what is going to happen with moscow well let me give you a little insight on what the actual combat design and the hero balance uh actual department has to say about moscow they said in the initial design phase for the hero they wanted to design themselves an archer with a wide range of damage uh, they constantly wanted to have to adjust positions in the game so you know you would have a stronger advantage to be able to adjust that uh, with a wide range and effect than any other heroes however after the hero they discovered basically it became very difficult to keep i guess at a reasonable level and that's why you really seen moscow has literally been in every match for i can't tell you the past how many weeks now uh, but what what it is is the uh, the apply cooldown for his first skill as a result of that it's too easy for him to gain attack speed early game and everybody's really used to playing moscow now he's really not that hard to play just positioning and stuff like that is all he really needs because he's so overpowered right now uh, basically what it is is they're going to discuss how to solve some problems with moscow nothing has been done yet this is just discussion of what they're about to go and look at changing on him uh the growth ability for his spells um what they're saying is moscow can do line clearing very quickly and on top of that his spells are pretty powerful as well 
the battle with the enemy is naturally avoided so it makes him impossible to catch as well so i mean he can get away with his a ability what they're going to do is grow the potential damage the i'm sorry grow the penetration damage with levels instead of actually being a set cap when it starts out uh, basically what they're saying is if they basically put a substantial growth for the penetration damage on the actual passive what that'll do is it'll still let you stay strong in the second half of the game but it'll kind of level Moskov out in the early part of the game and put him on a playing field with the rest of the characters that way he's not too overly powered in the first half of the game like he has been um, and the second thing that they're wanting to adjust is the attack speed of Moskov his first skill is what they're saying is it is attack speed is greatly increased and at the same time it reduces the cooldown of that first ability when you hit something uh, this allows you to get very high attack speeds quickly after teleporting without having to maintain any attack speed items therefore what they're going to do is lower the attack rate provided by this skill uh, throughout the adjustment moskov will not be able to quickly reduce the cooldown depending on the attack speed it provides and that means a reduction in the skills and the skills provided if this happens, Moskov will have to choose his attack speed and life and critical equipment more carefully. So, Moskov is about to get a severe nerf. Uh, they're going to have to adjust passives and they're going to have to adjust the A ability. Now, um, nothing has really been said about the B ability or his ultimate or anything like that. It's mainly his passive and his first ability that they're looking at adjusting. Uh, and it's pretty much just the growth that they're going to adjust on it uh, less passive damage to begin with early game and then with the a ability they're going to kind of level out that attack speed and the attack growth with that as well but yeah that's some pretty big changes coming up for moskov because like i said moskov is you know everybody's using this dude it's highly popular um and he's just really strong right now that's why he is being used so much but yeah guys let me know what you think about this change to Moskov and any of this other stuff that we talked about in this video. So yeah, that's going to be it, guys. If you have any questions, feel free to leave them in the comments below. And as always, like, comment, and subscribe. I am Soulbash. You guys have a nice day.